Hello there, viewers. It's been a while, but I am back now. I haven't posted a video for, I think, two weeks now. And that is exactly what I wanted to talk about in this video. There has been a lot going on in my life outside of YouTube, and I kind of wanted to let you guys know what is going on to give you guys a little bit of background as to why I haven't been uploading, why I haven't been playing my PS4 lately. Just, just a lot of stuff has been going on. But anyways, let's get right into it. And I'm going to start off with the main reason why. Because the main reason kind of ties into everything else. Basically, the main reason why I haven't been uploading or playing lately is because my PlayStation account got banned. But don't, there's a lot that ties into this story. Don't think right off the bat, oh, he's probably cheating or aimbotting or doing some type of hacks in the video game. No, that's not the case. So I'll take you guys way back into the beginning of June. I just graduated high school and I didn't have a job. I didn't have income. And this was around the time where the new season for Destiny 2 just came out, Season of Arrivals. And I didn't have any money or PlayStation Plus at that time. So my mom was kind enough to lend me her credit card. So I added her credit card as a payment method on my PlayStation and I added $20 to my wallet. $10 for the season pass and $10 for a month of PlayStation Plus subscription. At that point everything was great. I was playing the game that I love with a lot of people that I enjoy playing with. Everything was great. A few days later I got an email. An email that told me that somebody, somebody got unauthorized access to my PlayStation account. At this point I was very worried. Um, they started making a bunch of transactions through my mom's credit card. And it was crazy because my mom literally came into my room the exact right time as I'm reading that email. My mom asked me what the hell are you purchasing with my credit card. I told her nothing. After I told her that I didn't make any further transactions with her credit card, I showed her the email that I received that morning, and I told her to call her bank and get that money back. The next day, my mom got a letter in the mail saying that all the transactions that were made that were unauthorized were reversed. And at this point, I'm thinking, how did they get my information? Like, I have never, never given out my password to anybody. And I mean no one. I don't even give my password to my parents or my siblings. My PlayStation account basically got hacked. That same day, my mom told me to remove her credit card from my PlayStation. And I was quite okay with that because somehow somebody got my information. I don't know how though. So after all that happened, a few weeks later, I get another email. It was from PlayStation Network. They said they were banning my account because apparently my account was in debt. At that point, I was like, what did I do wrong? I didn't even do anything wrong. So I gave PlayStation a call and I told them about the situation with my mom's credit card and the anonymous hacker. And they said it would take a few days for them to investigate the situation. And at the end of the call, they said they would send me an email whether I am going to actually get my account back or not and then i was like whoa 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 hold on so you're probably not going to give me account my account back like what the fuck is this like i never did anything wrong like you guys are literally taking mo away my account for no reason like what is what is the reason like i never did anything at this point i was really pissed because I was missing out on all the content that Destiny was coming out with the next week, like Iron Banner, uh, Trials of Osiris, and just stuff that I really wanted to do in the game. It took them two weeks to give me my account back. While my account was banned, I was missing a lot of days that I could have been grinding on Destiny to get better gear and to finish stuff that I really wanted to do in the game. Towards the end, I kind of just accepted that everything has happened and I was just trying to be as patient as I could until I got my account back and I finally got it back. So I'm going to be on a lot more than I was and stay tuned for more videos because I will still be creating content for you guys. Please like and subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.
Yeah. <laughs>